Hello my beautiful souls, this is Moonseeker of Light Guardian and today I'm doing a check-in on the Twin Flame Collective for the weekend. So weekend vibes, let's see what's going on for us in the during this weekend. So let's just see what spirit wants to come forward. Things are going to be illuminated. Things are coming out of the shadows and into the light with this blue card here. We have four of cups, something about a missed offer. So something's being um, shed light on about a missed opportunity here, a missed offer. This could be you. This could be them. This is a journal reading and energies can interchange this. The energies could resonate for you or the person you're watching this for. But I'll be reading it from the point of view that this is the energy of the person you're watching this for. But the energies can change. I do use she and he for divine masculine, divine feminine. But those are not gender based. They're just energies. You can um, relate to whichever one, regardless of gender. So we got the four of cups there. We have the two of cups here. So this is something's being um, illuminated about a missed opportunity when it comes to a divine love. We also have the universe has your back, which is all about completion, harmony, and fulfillment. We also have the devil's card here. So shackled, shackled, and bound to something that needs to come to an end with this world card here. And lastly, we have the Hierophant, which is about commitment. So something needs to be unshackled and uh, has to come to completion so that there can be a proper commitment. So this weekend, things are going to come to light. Um, things, are come, come, things are coming out of the shadows here. And with this moon card here, use your intuition um, as to the information that will be flowing to you, whatever information that comes out. Uh, but this information relating to this four of cups here, this missed opportunity, if you offered someone your love or they offered their love to you, but something happened, you didn't accept, they didn't accept, um, something's going to come to light. Something's going to be revealed to you during the weekend here. This is a divine love. So this is your divine counterpart. So this will have to do with your divine counterpart here. This is what's going to be revealed about this offer is that perhaps the person you thought offered it to you wasn't, didn't see this as a relationship that was divinely guided, divinely um, orchestrated. But it is, it's, you have the two of cups here. So it's about your unity, your togetherness, your partnership. This is going to be revealed to you. What else is going to be revealed to you is that something needs to come to completion. In order for you to have your self-fulfillment and them to have their self-fulfillment, something needs to come to completion in order for there to be the harmony in this connection. People need to, um, to unshackle themselves to things that keep them bound in a lower vibrational energy. Addictions, people, places, things you know, codependency, um, because this commitment can't happen if people are still bound to these things. Let's get some clarifiers here. Why is the moon here? Why is the moon card here? Why is the moon card here? We have summer. We have awake and we have reflection and we have unspoken words. This is because someone has awoken. Your person has awoken to this journey, to this connection. This might have happened during the summertime. Um, they have had a lot of time to reflect on the things that happened between the two of you and the things that were left unsaid. Things that were not out in the open because they were asleep. They perhaps didn't use the words the way they should have. But we have unspoken words here. So things are coming out. This is why the moon is here. Mainly because of this. There's unspoken words between the two of you that need to be spoken. So the four of cups. Why is the four of cups here? Why is the Four of Cups here? Because of freedom. Someone perhaps thought their freedom freedom was going to be 
taken from them. Someone had an illusion that the they were losing the freedom. Something about um, being caged is what I'm getting. We also have divine love. Okay, so the four of cups is here because a divine love had a missed opportunity. The two of you had a missed opportunity. We have two cards here talking about love and love as a as a divine uh, connection. Uh, the four of cups is also here because new beginnings. You couldn't perhaps ha have those new beginnings with this divine love because of someone who thought their freedom was in jeopardy. Their freedom was um was being challenged. But we also have here fearful so someone was was um in 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 pride and ego and they were fearful they were fearful of this love they were fearful of a new beginning they were fearful of losing their freedom so hence not taking that four of cups there um not taking the offer of that love you were giving them we also have here contemplating they were contemplating about um can they truly be raw with you, be naked with you, mind, body, and soul. Do they really want to risk taking off, shedding all their skin and letting you in? No, they were fearful. So when this opportunity came to them, they let it go. So let's have a look at Two of Cups. Why is Two of Cups here? Just falling. Two of Cups is here because we have soul connection. We have twin flame. We have ebb and flow, and we have voyage. The divine. Uh, the Two of Cups is here is because this is a soul connection. This is a twin flame connection this is someone that you resonate with on a soul level this is about getting into the ebb and flow of what this voyage is really about what this soul connection journey twin flame journey is about this is why the two of cups is here is because this is about both of you learning what this journey is truly about and that is about getting into the ebb and flow of the universe, knowing that nothing can break this bond. But there is a, a, a trip you guys have to take separately and together when it comes to this, this soul connection. So let's have a look at the universe has your back. Why is that here? We have a leap because you just have to take a leap of faith. Trust that the universe has your back. Trust that things will come to completion and to in full circle the way it needs to be. We also have spark here. So this is about putting perhaps the spark back into your own self, to your own this card here, the universe talk about um, the universe has your back, talks about fulfillment. This is about putting the spark back into you, your self fulfillment. You being an individual outside of this connection, you pouring in that same love you do for this person into yourself, and knowing that the universe has your back, regardless if you guys are together or not. So let's look at Diablo here. Why is the devil here? So we have release, we have hidden, and we have balance. So this is about getting everything that's hidden beneath the surface out and releasing it so that you can find the balance you seek, so that your person can find the balance you seek. But I feel like this is for you too as well. Whatever is keeping you bound and shackled, needs to come out and come out in the open so that you can truly release it once and for all this could be people places or things so that you can have that balance the balance for yourself and the val balance for this connection so finally the hierophant why is the hierophant here why is the hierophant here
butterfly is a hierophant here because something needs to bloom blossom grow develop i want to get another card something needs to bloom something needs to um fall into place we have two cards talking about timing and seasons this could be that things will blossom and fall into place in the fall or the spring depending on where you are we also have soulmate here now so this is this could be that your person doesn't know the term term twin flame but we also got the soul connection card so i got four cards in this deck soul connection twin flame soulmate karmic partner um and the soul connection card is just like a blanket card for all four just indicating that it is a soul connection this is another confirmation that this is a soul connection a soul connection that needs to bloom and blossom it isn't quite there yet it hasn't it hasn't re reached its peak it has you know it's it's a these connections kind of always keep on growing but this connection right now is that your story is not over your story is not just memories yes you have fond memories memories people looking back at this being nostalgic and all that but there's more to this story there's more to this um thing we also have here um three is a crowd so again a third party situation may not be for all of you um but the here friend is here because there has perhaps been a third party situation that made perhaps this connection fall apart um and made it being you know something of the past something that's in your memories but we also have here thoughts and um and lost so i feel like your person is lost in thought when it comes to what happened here and the repercussions and consequences of their actions this could be that they were in a third third party situation but this could also be that you were in a third party situation but this has left them a little bit um in their thoughts about this feeling a little bit lost kind of lost their way lost their path when it comes to this to this oh, voyage and i just knocked all the cards over never mind uh when it comes to this voyage and how to to truly commit to this to this um this voyage without there being people placing the things getting in the way this is why i'm saying this energy this connection is young it still needs to grow it still needs to to you know the pieces still need to fall into place in this soul connection so um yeah that is the reading for today weekend energies this is what's going on for the twin flame collective during the weekend um i hope you guys enjoyed that please like comment subscribe share if you feel so inclined if you guys are interested in a personal reading all the information you need is in the description box below thank you again i see i'll see you next time bye